Are you a coffee or tea drinker and hate having to get up every few minutes to pop it back into the microwave to reheat it for that optimum taste? Well, today we're going to do an unboxing, review and scientific test on the Mr. Coffee Mug Warmer. Hey, welcome back to Rad Pro. Today is another 20 days of unboxing and potential giveaways. So without further ado, let's get started. This is the Mr. Coffee Mug Warmer. This is meant for anybody that loves hot beverages. This is going to help you keep your uh, coffee or tea hot in between sips. Or if you're in the office and you keep drinking your coffee in the morning, it's going to help you keep it warm. So without further ado, let's get to the unboxing. So I don't expect it there to be too much of uh, unboxing on this. This is fairly straightforward. So these they come with instructions, but again, we don't need these. So let's see. All right. So this is fairly bigger than I expected. It's going to help you um, keep different mugs of different sizes warm. So it comes with an on and off button. It has a light to let you know that it's on. And of course it plugs into the wall. So I want to do a more scientific test. So we'll use a thermometer and see how much better it is to have this uh, compared to just keeping your coffee on your desk. So let's get to it. Now to start our semi-scientific testing, uh, we have some boiling water. On the right hand side, we have the control mug while on the left-hand side, we have the Mr. Coffee Mug Warmer. So to start, we have 184 degrees Fahrenheit in both mugs. And I'm excited to see if the Mug Warmer will actually make a big difference. After five minutes, we see a significant drop in both mugs with 20 degrees drop from 184. So now we're at 164. I did not expect this, this much of a drop within such a short amount of time. Coming up on the 10 minute mark, this is where we see the mug warmer taking the lead um, with a four degree difference. Mr. Coffee mug warmer is at 154 while the control is at 150. Another five minutes pass and we're at the 15 minute mark. We see the difference already double. So we have the mug warmer at 147 degrees while the control is at 139. So it's definitely starting to make a big, big difference. Up to the 20 minute mark, we see that the mug warmer is at 142 degrees Fahrenheit while the control dropped all the way down to 131. So now we're at 11 degree difference between the mug warmer and the control. Yet another five minutes pass and we're at the 25 minute mark with the mug warmer taking a huge lead already with um, the mug warmer being at 137 degrees Fahrenheit while the control drops to 124. That shows a difference of 13 degrees, which is pretty good if you're asking me. So the 30 minute mark, we see the control actually dropped to about 119, but the mug warmer, we are at 134. So that's about a 15 degree difference. So coming up to the 35 minute mark, we have the mug warmer at 131 degree Fahrenheit. Uh, and it's starting to show that it's dropping less and less. So I'm thinking this is where um, kind of the sweet spot for the mug warmer. So now at the 40 minute mark, we see that the mug warmer is at 129 degrees Fahrenheit, uh, which we again see a slower and slower drop in temperature. And now coming up to the 45 minute mark, we see it drop to 126 Fahrenheit. So it's still way above 120 degrees Fahrenheit. 
All right, so personally, I think the Mr. Coffee mug warmer definitely makes an awesome difference. Let me know what you think in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up, share this with your friends, and don't forget, help us reach a thousand subscribers by November 30th, and we'll launch the 20 days of giveaways. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Oh, 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 oh,